Listen, if you are fat, plus size, or overweight, I need you to tune in to this video. Because my video message is um, another observation that I made, and I'm about to debunk what a lot of society says. Now, when it comes to a fat and overweight or a plus size woman, just so you all know, it is a culture now. Back in the 90s, that was kind of like the supermodel era where really thin women or women with like model type body frames, they were desired and sought after by a lot of men. Even in the media, even in a lot of movies, you were the it girl if you were really slim or you were really thin. But at some point, the trajectory of that lifestyle and looking that way, it changed. And so now plus size women are desired. A lot of men are attracted to plus size women and it has become more so a culture being a plus size or fat or overweight woman. Now, everybody is not going to agree with that, but I'm telling you guys the truth. But this notion that a lot of people have that fat, overweight, or plus size women are easier to sleep with, easier to manipulate, easier to use for their money, car, and house, I need you guys to stop with these lies. Somebody is lying. <laughs> That's what my video message is. Somebody is lying because if... Most men really felt and believed in their in their heart that fat and overweight or plus size women are disgusting. They are not sought after in a dating world. Men don't want them. Men want a, just a thick woman or a slim, smaller, petite woman. Why are we still seeing fat women get married? Why are we still seeing fat women bear children? Why are we still seeing fat women get engaged? Why are we still seeing fat women in exclusive relationships with men? You guys got to stop always putting out things in the airwaves because that's how you personally feel. You can't speak for every man. If you're the type of man that you personally don't like a heavier woman, you can't speak for all men and say what every other man wants because real talk, there are many men out here. They literally are attracted to and desire fat women. They literally are attracted to plus size and overweight women. I also want to let you guys know that I know a lot of this stuff that I hear and that I see in the media and on the internet is a lie. Because if fat women are the ones that are easier to sleep with and use and manipulate and they will allow you to treat them any type of way because they're desperate or because they're fat and don't get a lot of attention and love, what are you all saying about the small women that go through the same thing? There are very thin women that I see on a day-to-day -day basis and that I personally know and they're real small and petite and men are using them for their house for their money, for their car, they're beating them, they're giving them numerous STDs, and they're always cheating on them, and they are considered a dime piece or really small. What do you all say about that? This is why I say somebody's lying. Somebody's lying. If the truth is, according to a lot of you all out here in the world, if the truth is you have to be slender and you have to go to the gym, in order to be sought after and in order for a man to want you and um, pursue you, why are we still seeing fat women get married and have children and they're getting engaged and they are happy and a man that is in their life is happy versus you'll see a lot of small women get cheated on, get beat and get rejected by men. I think what needs to start being talked about is just a simple fact. Like I told you all before, people like who they like. And if you are the type of man, you intentionally seek out fat, overweight, or plus size women to use them for money, to use them for their car, 
to connect to them because you see a vulnerability or you see brokenness in them, my brother, you better really be careful with what you're doing and you need to really change your heart and your character. You really need to change your heart and your character because see a lot of you all, you all go out here and you use people and you take advantage of them and you all feel like this stuff won't catch up to you later. There's no way you can live your life taking advantage of people, using them for their house, using them for their money, using them for their car or whatever. And you feel like things are going to go good for you in life and you feel like your life is going to be blessed. You cannot possibly believe that you're going to have a blessed and prosperous life when you seek a particular class or group of people out to just use them for your personal gratification or benefit. And I don't even understand the whole thing about fat plus size or overweight women being easier to sleep with because I know women that are 95, 100, 120 pounds, 135 pounds, and they will sleep with a man the first night that they meet him. I know very small women, the same night they met a man at a club or at a bar, two hours later, they were in the bed with him. A week later, they were in the bed with him or two weeks later, they were in the bed with him. So what are you all saying about that class and that body type of women? I had to make this video because I have heard for a large part of my life and I speak on behalf of all overweight plus size and um, fat women, and I, I hate to use that word, but I have to be blunt because this is what you all label a plus size woman. It may sound mean to some people, but that's just what it is. You guys catch my drift and you know what I'm trying to insinuate here. I don't understand how you all simply because somebody has extra weight on them, you truthfully believe and you assume that you could get away with certain things with them just because they're fat. There is no way. I haven't been played by no man and I'm a plus size woman because I don't want to use the word dummy. I, that's, that's really bad. But I guess those of us who have a prayer life and like I say, the gift of discernment or we're just intelligent and very observant, and we ask questions and we pay attention and study people. Women like me, we don't get caught up and involved in mess like that. Because I'm looking at your character. I'm looking at how you act. I'm looking at how you treat me and how you're talking to me. So I wouldn't fit that category. And I don't understand why you all truthfully will only try to approach like I said that certain class of women I have seen men make jokes and laugh and say oh fat women are better in bed oh fat women can cook but what does weight being on somebody extra weight have to do with their sexual performance or them being able to cook didn't honestly a lot of this stuff that i hear it sounds really stupid to me years ago it sounded dumb to me i'm i'm i would sit back like what what are these people even talking about they sound so stupid they sound so stupid so in my video message guys like i said somebody is lying you guys can come in my comment section because i know you coming and you can break down or tell me why people still to this day in 2022 believe this. Maybe back in the day it was like that. Because back in the day when I went to school with certain overweight women and, you know, girls, um, I did see a lot of them that were broken with low self-esteem and they would quickly have sex with a guy or they would have a reputation for doing sexual things with a guy and um they would always say that the girl did it because she was fat and i've had men tell me well uh fat big girls need love too 
and they don't get as much as t attention as a small woman. W what are you guys talking about? I've seen heavy women and bigger women get more attention than a small girl that's considered the dime piece or considered just thick. That's what my video message is. I want you guys to start thinking about this stuff and I want you all to start paying attention to this stuff. And if you are a man that is just seeking out a certain type of woman because you want to use that woman, I need you to search your heart. I need you to look at your nasty, disgusting character because who the hell are you to try to approach a woman that's big or overweight and you just know for a fact because she's fat? Oh, I could pull her. Oh, I could get her. Oh, she's going to spend money on me. I'm going to drive her car. I'm going to move in her house. Now, honey, when you come across the wrong heavy set woman, all of us not dumb like that and in the dark. This is why I put out these videos because I want you all to be more conscientious and pay attention to the characters of people. A lot of mess that you all have got involved in, a lot of stuff that you have experienced is simply because you are not studying people, you are not probing them, you are not asking them questions. And you all repeatedly, time after time after time, get into these relationships and you deal with these different people knowing you are not healed knowing you are battling low self-esteem, knowing you are broken, knowing you are not complete. And so the little bit of attention that you get, ladies, from a man, uh, overweight women, you take it and you run with it, and some of you all fall in love, and when you see the man really didn't want you, he just wanted to use you for sex or your money or whatever, you trying to understand why. But from jump, he was showing you that he really wasn't into you like that. And you men, I'm just confused because you all say that you don't like fat plus size or overweight women. But why do you all keep going to bed with them? Do you know how stupid that makes you look? If I don't like you, I say this in so many videos. If I don't like you, I don't, I don't want you touching me. If I was in a world. And I chose to go ahead and have sex outside of marriage and I'm really feeling you. If I, or, oh, I'm sorry, if I'm not feeling you, I don't want you touching me. Actually, to be honest, I don't want you in my presence. I don't want to hang around you if I'm not feeling you. Period, point blank. Like I said, come in my comment section, guys, because somebody is lying i'm not saying that in a world of plus size fat and overweight women some women are not easy to manipulate and use that are big but if men are so disgusted by fat overweight and plus size women why are we still seeing these type of women get married and have children and be exclusive in relationships and the man is genuinely and sincerely happy with her that's what the video message is.